Hello Taurus and welcome to your February 2019 future love reading. This is for Taurus. What is going on with Taurus? What is going on with their future love for February 2019 for Taurus? What is going on with their future love? This is for Taurus. Taurus. Hmm. We have romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. So that's very nice. <coughs> <coughs> happens every time. Excuse me. I'm not starting over because these are good cards. We have true love at the bottom of the deck. This is the romance of a lifetime. So this person is really feeling it for you. They are all up in their feels. Feeling like this is a true love situation. And possibly the feelings are mutual here. All right, Tora. So let's see where this is going. This is for Tora. It's for February 2019 for Taurus. If this resonates with you, Taurus, please like, share, and subscribe, and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you, Taurus, please check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign, as this will not resonate with every Taurus out there. Please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. So however it resonates with you, this is for Taurus. For February 2019, this is for Taurus. This is for Taurus. What is going on with their future love for Taurus? Yeah, they definitely have some emotion here for you. Oh, and it's making him nervous. All right. Wow. Okay. So I don't think they know how you're feeling here, like how you're truly feeling here, Taurus. We have the high priestess here. So this is secrets. I don't think you have revealed to them or maybe they haven't revealed to you how they are feeling, but they're seeing you, I think, as very mysterious, right? Um, maybe you guys haven't had this conversation yet, but um, there will be clarity here. All right. There will be clarity here. Um, you see her pomegranate curtain, right? It has not fallen yet. So everything has not been revealed yet. Maybe they have not revealed everything to you. Okay. Because they, they are having a hard time walking away from you. Okay. All right. So going by their intuition, right? Definitely. Uh, we have the high priestess here at the bottom of the deck. I've got water here. I've got Leo here. I've got air here. It could be any sign. I'm going to read the energies of the card. So um, they're feeling like this could be a true love situation. And either you have not revealed to them how you are feeling or they haven't revealed this to you. I'm thinking maybe you haven't revealed it to them, but um, the situation is this King of Cups. So yes, trying to go by intuition here for sure, right? They have a lot of emotion here for you. They have rom romantic feelings here for you, Taurus, right? This is the King of Cups, Water Energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Um, this is the kind of energy that uh, wants to follow their heart in a situation. And I think it's given them quite a bit of anxiety, right? Maybe the thing is here, they're trying, they're thinking about telling you how they are feeling because we have the nine of swords here. Um, this is air energy, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So this is them thinking, overthinking, being up at night, um, just all up in their head about it. High anxiety here. So this is a situation where 
either they're stressing out because they are planning on telling you how they feel or they don't know 100% if you feel the same way, right? So either way it goes, this is them having a lot of sleepless nights and being all up in their head about the situation. So the challenges here is they simply cannot walk away from you. They have a hard time walking away from you. That's the challenge. We have the Eight of Cups here, more water energy. Um, the feelings are very intense for them and uh, the connection is strong. And it's like, I feel like it's, it's a situation where they've tried maybe to walk away from you before and they can't. So what action is going to occur here is the sun card, which is very good. The sun is the happiest card of the tarot deck. This, this is going to reveal a lot of things, okay? I feel like if they have not um, told you how they feel, they will. Um, if you are having a hard time speaking your truth, I feel like you're going to speak it. Um, and this pomegranate curtain is going to fall here. I feel like there's going to be an exchange of emotion here between the two of you. And I feel like there's going to be a brand new beginning here because they're having a hard time walking away from you. They can't do it. And it's, be and it's because, well, you're their true love. That's kind of what's going on here, Taurus. Okay. Um, the outcome here is the queen of swords so clarity is going to definitely be given in the situation all right we're going to be speaking our truths here we have the queen of swords this is air energy gemini libra and aquarius so um this person you know as an as an energy male or female has been through a lot um has seen a, a lot um a, bad relationships probably, uh, needs clarity in a situation, needs communication in a situation. Um, I feel a little bit of impatience here, either on your end or their end, um, but I feel like we're going to get the clarity that we need. All right, so let's clarify the Queen of Swords for Taurus. What's going on with their future love? What's going on with their future love? What's going on here? February 2019. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. We have the Ace of Cups. This is a brand new beginning. There's definitely going to be an exchange of emotion here. Um, this is absolutely gorgeous. This card's been popping out a lot for these future love readings, I'm telling you. Brand new beginnings in love. And we're going to get the clarity that we need. I feel like we're going to be speaking our truths and sharing emotion here. This is a very good thing. And then this is going to be a whole new chapter here. All right. So we've got brand new beginnings in love. We're putting the past um, behind us. We're getting closure. And we're starting whole new chapters with the world card here. So that's very, very good. I feel like, you know, sun is going to shine on this situation. It's going to be a very happy time. New beginnings, right? New beginnings. New beginnings. Happiness. Emotion overflowing. Um, the feelings are real. And as stressed out as this person is over the whole situation... I just feel like there's too much emotion there for them to truly walk away from you. They, they just can't do it. So we're going to get um, like this epiphany moment. This, you know, the sun's going to shine on this. Any hidden emotion uh, between the two of you is going to be discussed and revealed to each other. And we're going to start this whole new chapter here, Taurus. All right? Because this could be a true love situation here for you. Wow. 
All right, that is a very good reading for your future love reading for February 2019. Sorry about my man sneezes, but it happens sometimes when I start reading these cards. <laughs> and I know they're loud. So sorry about that. Excuse me. <laughs> but these cards were too good. And I was, was not about to start over. All right. So very good reading, Taurus. I go live Sunday through Thursday with the daily message. And um, that is around noon Eastern Standard Time. Friday is the love, lust, or loss. Also around noon Eastern Standard Time. And then next week, I'll be getting out the March 2019 monthly readings. So stay tuned for all of that. You guys take very good care of yourself. And I hope you have... A great night. I'll talk to you soon. God bless.